Hey, how's it going? I'm Coach Kyle, and today we're gonna to talk about do compression socks work? And this is a super common question I see on Reddit and Facebook groups and Twitter. And it's a very general question because, you know, first off, we're like, oh, what, what, are, you, what are you asking? What's work? But today I'm gonna to talk about a, a recent research study that looked at if compression helps with marathon recovery. So if you don't know, I'm Coach Kyle and I work with adult distance runners all over the world, optimizing your running, your strength work, and your nutrition, bringing it all together with great accountability and motivation and sprinkling on some gratitude practice and meditation as well. So if that sounds like your jam, go to kylecrans.com, check out that coaching information, fill out that application form, let's chat about how we can up your game. But today we're talking about compression socks. And I'm sure you've seen runners at race expos or out on the road wearing these super stylish and sexy knee-high, knee-high bright socks. And you've often wondered, uh, you know, what are those? Or if you know what they are, you've often maybe wondered, do they actually work? And I wouldn't be surprised if you have a pair, but do they actually work? So compression socks typically come in you know, compression socks or you can get a full compression tight. And they are medical grade compression. They're not just like snug or tight. And be, be aware that you can buy compression socks that are just like snug, but they're not medical grade compression. And the idea is that they help increase blood flow. They get blood from down below up and moving through your body to enhance your recovery. And typically it's recommended that these don't really work when sleeping because your body is like this and so it can you know the blood can flow a little better but throughout the day i typically will wear these if i do a like today for example i'm not running until a group run tonight at 5 45 so i'm wearing compression socks basically all day if i were to do a morning workout or a morning like a morning long run this this sunday i'll do one i'm gonna wear compression socks for the entire rest of the day after that long run to enhance my recovery. I have a pair of tights and I have a pair of socks and I will wear both of them. I bet five to six days out of the week, I'm wearing compression socks or tights. So let's get into what you wanted to know. Do compression socks actually work? And I wanna talk about a 2015 study that had marathon runners do a treadmill exhaustion test in a lab two weeks before and then they did a marathon, and this was made up of three different marathons in Australia. So they did a treadmill time to exhaustion test two weeks pre-marathon, they did the marathon, and then they did the same treadmill test two weeks later. But one group wore compression socks for 48 hours after that marathon, and one unlucky group didn't. And then they both did the same repeat of that treadmill test. So there are about 15 people in each group and two weeks after the marathon, the people who wore the compression socks for those 48 hours after the marathon, they actually ran that exhaustion test 2.6% longer than when they did it before the marathon. And that's, that's super interesting. And the people that wore the fake compression socks, so they were just tight enough that they wouldn't fall down, they actually ran 3.6% less time after the marathon for that second time trial. And this is really interesting. This means that the, the runners that wore the compression, they actually got more fit after the marathon than they were two weeks before when, when I assumed they were doing some sort of taper for that marathon. So they, they ran faster two weeks after that marathon. So the moral of the story is, yeah, compression probably helps your recovery. And like, like I said, I do. I typically just wear them throughout the day when I'm not running. I don't really wear them while running because there's not as much research showing that compression helps you run faster or recover better while running. But as worn as a recovery tool, yeah, they probably help a little bit. And they're, they're extraneous. So they you wear them and you don't really have to do anything else. Uh, it's not related to your running or your nutrition. It's a $30 purchase that you can just throw on and it probably helps and it's highly unlikely you're gonna have any negative reactions to wearing compression. Now, things to consider are that 
you have different compression options. You have calf sleeves, which go from basically the ankle to below the knee. Now those are not super helpful, the lowest common denominator type thing, because they don't cover the bottom of the foot, and they don't go above the knee. So those are nice to wear during workouts. Maybe if you have like a calf problem, you can wear those during a workout to reduce that muscle oscillation, the movement of the muscle while running. And that might be a good kind of injury avoidance thing if you're having calf problems. And that is part of the reason why compression while running may help recovery because it may reduce that muscle oscillation and the damage done. But as a recovery tool, I tend to not suggest sleeves, no, but full compression socks or compression tights that go all the way from you know knee all the way down as a sock or ankle all the way up to your waist those are really going to help with that recovery also something to consider are you've maybe seen those giant compression boots where you sit and you you basically put your your legs in these giant like soft tubes and those those pulsate a little bit those are not cheap either by the way I'm not sure about those, honestly, because you, you don't sit in them all, the, all day. You sit in them for maybe you know, 30, 60 minutes, whatever. Whereas compression socks and like the bang for your buck has got to be really low on those. However, compression socks or compression tights, you, know, you spend 30, 60 bucks on a pair of those and you're going to get a full year or two of compression throughout the day for a pretty minimal price. And like I said, there's not really any drawback from wearing compression and it probably is doing some benefit. So there we have it. Straight away after this video, I'm gonna link you to some other videos that I think you'll find helpful and informative if you liked this one. If you did like this one, give it a thumbs up. I always appreciate that. Questions, comments, drop them in the comment section below. If you wanna pick up a pair, I'll link you to a couple options in the show notes down below too. Those are affiliate links, so I really appreciate that. And as always, you keep running, I'll keep coaching.